sincerity and authenticity of, of you looking in the mirror and doing a moral audit. I'm doing this and I'm feeling that. I'm fighting for this and I'm just as much part of the problem and solution. And you talk about as long as we are conflicted within, we will continue to live in conflict without. Right. And if you're going to do this work, what guides it? And my, in reading your book, the answer is clear that if you're going to go figure out how to navigate the conflict, uh, you rooted yourself in a set of values that were your compass. So what I'd love for you to do is tell us about the relation, what were the values, what is the relationship between values and sorting out the inner journey so that you could have an outward, outward one. And then put your teacher hat on. If others were inspired and wanted to do some internal excavation, what are the, how do they go about it? Well, values are, for me, it wasn't uh, the value, it's one value mm. that I have to be in truth mm -hmm. between what I'm advocating for outside and what I'm really doing inside. Yeah. That's a value. The truth is a value for me, right? And so when you catch yourself, and, and, oh, because right now we are facing, I'm, I'm using an example from overseas, but right now America is facing that division between between Americans, yeah. you know, of each side is having a moral, uh, a righteousness yeah. about that value, you know, I, my value is correct. No, my value is correct, right? So for me, the value is like, am I living in truth to what I'm advocating for? And it's so much easier to tell everyone to judge you, to judge you, ju you are not doing this, I am doing this, right? Mm -hmm. For me, when I said, reversing the question and asking, am I doing this in a truthfulness, in the, in the essence of the truth?